Hello and welcome to this LEAF presentation video on willpower. I think we're up to number video number 8 now in the series and I'm filming this video for you from Hamburg. Have a look out, look out this window, I've got a great view of Hamburg and I'm going to read you a quote by Dan Millman. It's an absolute classic on willpower. Dan Millman said, Willpower is the key to success. Successful people strive no matter what they feel by applying their will to overcome apathy, doubt or fear. Now this video is on the power of will but not so much in the power on other people or circumstances but actually using the power of the will on your own self, your mind. And this special leaf presentation hopefully will help you control that mind more because that's really where all the secret is, the power of will on yourself. And as we're talking about leaf growth, check out the size of this leaf, I mean that's a big one. Here's a great quote uh, by Emerson. He said, the education of the will is the object of our existence. And this video really is about education, uh, education in terms of understanding the will on ourselves. Now, if you're finding this idea of using the will to make things different, to go for your goals or your aspirations, then try this little experiment. When you wake up in the morning, just monitor the thoughts that you're thinking on a second by second basis and ask yourself the question, are these thoughts serving me? And you'll soon begin to realize that you can use the will to work on your mental faculties. And this is the great secret to people that are successful in life. So we have this idea of monitoring our thoughts, a bit like holding the reins of a horse. You're having to take control of those thoughts on a second by second basis. Now with practice, this gets um, a lot easier. I'll explain a bit more. Now in Hamburg this weekend there's been a lot of wind and the wind has a habit of blowing all the leaves into big piles, big piles of leaves. But once those leaves have accumulated in a big large pile, they stay there even though the wind is still blowing and it's a bit like those thoughts you're having on a minute by minute basis. If you can choose positive thoughts, they compound and they build and eventually those thoughts contribute to you feeling in a positive manner. This is the great secret to life. Second by second in the morning, choose those thoughts carefully, compound them and eventually that will have a direct effect on your day. Try it and it, it really does work but it takes practice but imagine those leaves start with one thought then another, build that up bit by bit and eventually you'll find that it will compound. Now let's imagine that this uh, German beer that I have here uh, represents your thoughts and the foam on the top if you like are positive thoughts and you want those to dominate your every day but at the moment the sediment at the bottom uh, is negative thoughts so how can you change uh, your thinking? Well the only way is to add more positive thoughts into your daily practice so if I pour in Oops. if I pour in some more positive thoughts as you can see it's growing just like the head on this beer so you have to have the practice of thinking something positive a strong affirmation moment by moment by moment because just like the head on this beer it is eventually going to diminish and be taken over by more satisfactory or negative thoughts so uh, that's really the great secret just keep thinking moment to moment to moment something positive and uh, you'll find your day will change so until i see you again on this leaf presentation i'm going to leave you uh, from hamburg with a nice german beer and uh, you take care